the apostle is here. I noticed. Well, then you know who the chick with him was, don't I'm you? I'm the scion, I imagine. Shit, man. Oh, look, maybe we should rethink this whole thing. I mean, I mean, you heard the guy. He said there are consequences. And Azrael tells us we're marked. Look, man, there is more to this than we thought about. I was close. You know, I was so close to just slitting that bitch's throat. Mm. You know how I felt? Righteous. Justified. Eager, even. You all right, man? Your eyes are kind of... My eyes are open. For the first time, I get it. When that little innocent girl let her mission slip, I had an epiphany. See, in the beginning, it was just us and him, angels and God. Uh -huh. Then he created humans. Ours was designed to be a life of servitude and worship and bowing and scraping and adoration. He gave them more than he ever gave us. He gave them a choice. They choose to acknowledge God or choose to ignore him. All this time we've been down here, I've felt the absence of the divine presence, and it's pained me, as I'm sure it must have pained you. And why? Because of the way he made us. Had we been given free will, we could choose to ignore the pain, like they do. But no, we're servants. Okay. You know, all I'm saying here is that one of us might need a little nap. Wake up! These humans have besmirched everything he's bestowed upon them. They were given paradise, they threw it away. They were given this planet, they destroyed it. They were favored best among all his endeavors, and some of them don't even believe he exists. And in spite of it all, he has shown them infinite fucking patience at every turn. What about us? I asked you once to lay down the sword because I felt sorry for them. What was the result? Our expulsion from paradise. Where was his infinite fucking patience then? It's not right, it's not fair. We've paid our debt. Don't you think it's time? Don't you think it's time we went home? And to do that, I, I think we may have to dispatch our, our would-be dispatchers. Wait, 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 kill them? You're talking about the last Scion, for Christ's sake. And what about Jay and Bob? I mean, those guys were all right. Don't, don't, my friend. See, don't let your sympathies get the best of you. They did me once. Scion or not, she's just a human. And by passing through that arch, our sins are forgiven. No harm, no foul. My God, I've heard a rant like this before. What did you say? I've heard a rant like this before. Don't you fucking do that to me. You sound like the morning star. You shut your you fucking mouth, You sound like sir. Lucifer, man. You fucking lost it. You're not talking about going home, Bartleby. You're talking about fucking war on God. Well, fuck that. I have seen what happens to the proud when they take on the throne. I'm going back to Wisconsin. <laughs> We're going home, Loki, and no one not you, not even the Almighty himself is going to make that otherwise.